Hello everyone. I'd like to share with you a few trades that were posted on Wednesday, 21st of June 2023. These trades were shared by AP who's trading S&P 500 in form of CFD. As you see the 4 hour macro chart is showing breakdown and you can see in 1 hour a structural chart the downturn channel and he identified area of pullback that got completed and entered two position and managed them and exit with exit strategy number two with profits. Also when the price got rejected at the support level, he identified the area that buyers came back and entered here with setup B with multiple positions and we can see that is managing and trailing this to close on the other side of the channel with profit. So thank you AP for sharing your trades with us. The next trade was shared by AA who's trading NASDAQ CFD. As you see the macro chart is in downtrend and we can see the red candles that is forming lower low constantly and we can see downtrend channel in the structural chart here and using the 10 second trading chart he identified an area of pullback and entered here and managed to close this with profit using exit strategy number one. So thank you AA for sharing your trades with us. The next trade was shared by Ren or Global Instructor and Programmer who's trading S&P 500 CFD. As we see the channel on the one minute chart here is showing the structural chart that is going up and is aligned with the higher time frames. So when the pullback got completed using ALGO 125, he entered in this area and set the stop here with very good risk to reward ratio and close this on the other side of channel using exit strategy number one with very good risk to reward ratio and profit. So thank you Rain for sharing your trades with us. The next trades were shared by Castro or Global Instructor who's trading USD Japanese Yen. As you see the macro chart of one hour showing uptrend and when the pullback got completed, he entered in this area with very good risk to reward ratio and managed and closed this with very good runner and high profit. The next trade also was shared by Castro who's trading USD CAD and as you see the macro is in downtrend and entered in this area with very good risk to reward ratio and as you see it's getting close to the target. The next trade that Castro shared was on S&P 500. The price broke this dynamic support area and he identified the area of downtrend and entered again here with very good risk to reward ratio and managed and closed this one also with profit. So thank you Castro for sharing your trades with us. The next trades were shared by Yan or Global Instructor who is trading Nasdaq futures. As you see the macro chart is in downtrend and you can see the downtrend channel in one minute structural chart. So using 10 second trading chart he identified multiple area of pullback and entered here based on algo 125 and managed and closed this with exit strategy number one. And the result of these four trades shows 100% win rate and the average winning trades were 122 and the largest winning trade was $150. So thank you Yan for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades are those that I have taken during the New York market session and the video with detailed explanation was sent to students yesterday. So I'm going to replay the video here for you. Hello everyone. I'd like to share with you the trades that I have taken today on Wednesday, 21st of June 2023. These trades were taken on NASDAQ and also Dow Jones Industrial Average Futures. If you look at the macro chart of hourly, we can see the market was going down constantly last few days. And you can see on NASDAQ daily here, it was selling strongly. So we can see that during the global session, uh, the price fluctuating around these points of control on all minutes, which is the previous day close. And then before the market opens, it started to go down. And so I waited for the price to stabilize. And when on Dow Jones tested this level and the price got rejected, the buyers came back. So these green candles were taken with the long position on this uptrend channels here repeatedly. And then I came back close to the end of the market and I saw the price is testing this support level on NASDAQ. And you see these candles just before the market closed, traded this area, these two candles here and here, just before the market closed with long positions. And you can see the entry of long positions and exits. So these signals were copied by copy trader.
to multiple Apex Trader Funds accounts and the result was showing that we reached profit factor of 5.28 with 70% win rate from long sides and the average win to loss ratio was 2.19 the largest winning trade was 260 and the largest losing trade was $69. So hope this trade taken by the PAT system is useful for you and let us know if you have any questions. Have a wonderful day.